God is shit. It's killing me already. <sighs> hey guys, it's G. I'm about to watch. Yeah, see now I'm giggly. I can't get. Oh, fuck. I'm about to watch Arrow episode 512 called Bratva. Yeah, Russia. Bring it. I will. Uh, I will talk to you in the comments afterwards. Okay. Bye. -bye. What are we doing here? These are low-level drug dealers. They're target practice. Live target practice. He likes you. She's just... Okay, Oliver, she's not the queen I'm seeing. It's sort of an old-fashioned way to say it, don't you think? Well, I'm not really sure how else to put it, uh, given that we haven't progressed. The funny way of saying we haven't slept together? <clears throat> Hi. Lance Hi. is back. Quentin? The fact that he said they didn't sleep together yet, we knew that. But it also means it's going to happen during this episode. Yeah. Fuck. What can you tell us? Lots. But first, welcome back. Let's kiss this warm feelings. Let's kiss this warm feelings. We need the whole team for this. Agreed, but Quinn just got out of rehab, and with Thea out of town, I... I need Thea's to still out of town? Did you mind? <laughs> That's a bad idea. By the way, I just got off the phone with Oliver, who says he's on the way to Russia. So what are you doing here? Oliver said I'm supposed to help you prep for your interview with Susan Williams. Mm. And it was safer for me to be here than over there starting an international incident. Also, you need to talk to your receptionist. She didn't believe I was here for you. I had to sneak past her just to get in. Wow, mm. I wonder how she could have made that mistake. Oh, I miss Lance. Go home. Miss your hockey mask or something. Missed him. Oliver, you were here the whole time. When I saw Dawn, I didn't think I'd be stopping a nuclear arms sale in a foreign country. She looks pretty. When I saw Dawn, I didn't think I'd be dealing with aliens. Aliens? Yeah. <laughs> John said you had friends in Russia? One friend reached out, didn't hear back. Oh, you're yeah. a queen. And it totally. <laughs> we never should have come back to Russia. And I'm usually a very, very, very big fan of Anatoly, but I don't know, I have a feeling this episode is either going to make me want to punch him hard, or, you know, I don't know. Don't, don't, don't make me hate Anatoly. I can't hate Anatoly. John Diggles, good to see you. Now you're my favorite American. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> so, a day owe you money. His name's in my father's notebook. And for good reason. Mr. Yamane's criminal enterprise really is weird responsible for much of the suit designer drug trade with, the, with the wig on. Your contacts in Russia, too? Well, kind of. Uh, he might need a little bit of convincing. Think you two could look like Bratva? <laughs> oh, dear Lord. Sorry, I mean, Rusty. I can't see what I mean. Those guys don't say sorry. Yeah. Right, no yeah, frosty. How is this going to work? Guys, focus. Why Pretty dress. Here with us. Who is that? Who is that? Maxim Obchowski. You speak English. I suggest you start using it. Who are you? What do you want? To talk. In private. Don't make me ask you again. It's impressive that she can do this without, you know, Cracking a smile or babbling or who are you? Someone who needs access to your system's credentials. You work for Detrolink. Not for long, I won't. If I gave you my sign in materials. Honey, you didn't seem worried about losing your job when you ignored company policy to notify the Kremlin about certain suspicious and terrorist like activity on your network last year. How do you know about that? Better question is who would I tell? Yeah, that's because all of her issues. Sure the Kremlin would love to hear <laughs> about this. Hmm. Time to go. What else, Steve? That guy was seriously shaken. What'd you say? What he needed to hear. I've got what we need to get a location on Walker. Yeah, he doesn't trust it. There. Oh, there are civilians here. I don't care, Oliver. This may be our only shot. Dude. <laughs> you guys all right? I'm really liking Tina or Dinah. She's, she's an asset to the team. And it doesn't feel like, oh, I need to do a hair flip or I need to do a little pose. Or she just, she does her thing. She walks in, turns and goes, are you guys all right? 
and it works for me, and I'm really digging Tina right now. Tina, Dinah, whatever. Stop! Stop! Nothing stops. Nothing stops until you tell me when and where the buy is happening. Now you have five minutes to decide what you want your face to look like. You know what? I like all of the badass. You just got out of rehab. What makes you think you're still fit to serve as deputy mayor? Well, uh, that's a very excellent question, Susan. Ms. Williams. Ms. Williams. <clears throat> well, I think it's my dedication to the city. I have lived here my, my whole life. So have lots of people. And I'm pretty sure not all of them are recovering alcoholics. I think it's been my ability to persevere. What are you persevering through? Could you be more specific? Well, I'm trying to. Would you let me get a word in edgewise, please? You think Susan Williams is going to go any easier? He's got a point. No. When did the drinking begin? Was it before or after the death of your daughter, Laurel? What did you just say? Do you hold yourself accountable for her death? Or for working with Damien Dark? Oh, shut your damn mouth about my daughter. Dude, chill. I'm just trying to help. You trying to help? Great. I'm going to leave here. And when I get back, you don't be here. Yeah, but that's exactly the kind of question Susan would get would ask, so I can't fault Renee for doing that. I wasn't having any luck locating Walker, so I just thought I'd work on my frustration in private. You're hiding things, what? babe. Sometimes you gotta fight fire with fire. I'm not worried about them. I'm worried about you. Hmm? I thought you were working on locating Walker. Yeah. Is everything okay? This might be none of my business, but I think she crossed the line to find Walker. Rory. What line? Stay here. Oh, yeah, we're getting... Oh, no, dude, no. No. He's crossing the line. That's enough. That's enough. I thought we were doing this my way. Your way wasn't fast enough, Oliver. I'm not letting Walker get away. Neither am I. What's happening? What happened? John got a little carried away. Did he say anything? <sighs> what is happening? Get yourself cleaned up. I'll be back. Where are you going? I'm going to handle this. Uh, I know exactly what's happening. Diggle's going dark. Felicity's going dark. And Oliver's gonna be delight. <laughs> be still my heart all oh. this is why I love this show these 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 people have layers like you wouldn't believe and it's all oh, I'm eating it up yeah I need a break thanks <laughs> coming as backup or for not telling anyone both <laughs> Russian got better. You know, the other guy said when you get in one of your moods, I should just let you be. But um, to be honest, brooding really kind of gets in my nerves. <laughs> he told you about me. To make you scott in your head. What was it, some crap about infecting the people closest to you? Yeah, and tonight I watched John torture a man. There's something going on with this thing. You affect the people in your life, Oliver. That's hardly a revelatory observation. Yeah, in fact, I, I think it's uh, it's called living. Prometheus has you so fixated on what's wrong with you, you've completely stopped seeing what's right. You know, John and Felicity, they'll listen to you because you have more to offer than just this. See? I like her. Your past is a part of you. There's nothing you can do about that. You can't change it. Doesn't mean it has to be your anchor. Um, yeah, I really like her. Can I come in? Or is it still no dogs allowed? <laughs> you really got a wise ass mouth, honey, don't you? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. But did you just say my mouth looks like ass? Look, I just came in here to tell you that Susan Williams' producer called to confirm that 10 a.m. tomorrow still works for the interview. Where are you? Did you take Dinah somewhere? Yeah, not like that. Okay, huh? what happens in Russia stays in Russia, remember? Where's Walker's man? Curtis and Rory are keeping eyes they on They brought him. it up. We had a tone that wasn't playing ball unless you did the breakfast dirty work. 
Which is where you took Dino. Oliver, I thought you didn't want anything to do with the Brock farm. I don't, but if there's a choice between me crossing the line and the two of you crossing one, that is a very easy choice. Uh, What'd you do? Doesn't <laughs> matter. He's with us. I am who I am. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm trying to work past that. Maybe I do, maybe I don't, but I cannot, I will not have the two of you make the same mistakes. Oliver, you are the one that taught us that sometimes you have to get in the muck to make things right. Well, then Prometheus wins. Because he'll be right. I need the two of you to prove to him, and quite frankly, to prove to me that he's not. I need the two of you to be better than me. Because you are. That's why we work together. Oh, OTA moment. I live for that shit, I really do, and I've missed it this season so far. Oliver has really grown over this past these past five seasons into a person that I absolutely adore with every fiber in my being. I basically love every every aspect of him. Even this thing with Susan, you know what? The guy's trying. He's trying to move on with someone new and He's, he's trying to do better and he just keeps getting sucked back in and that parallels perfectly with Felicity. He's trying to move on with Susan, but there's going to be a, come a point where he can't. Can you tell I'm loving this episode so far? And there's someone I'm trying to avoid. American government. <laughs> I wish it were just that. <laughs> <laughs> Crap. Bomb's not here. Walker's headed for the hangar. Odds are that's where the nuke is. Felicity! What, what are you doing? The so bomb is in countdown mode. What? To wire with the failsafe, we must have triggered it when we entered the hangar. Can you disarm it? If I can, the yield of this thing will spread over 50 miles. Yeah, they're gonna stop it. Do Haven it. Rock is not gonna happen you again. No, he won't. What, what, what are you doing? Hopefully, like hell, I can figure out how to fly a plane. What? I can't disarm the nuke, but hopefully I can get into a less populated area. Less populated? Like Haven Rock? This isn't the time to revisit that. No, 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 this is exactly the time. The, the regs survived Haven Rock. They can survive this too. I, I can use them to contain the blast and the radiation. No, you don't know that. Well, I don't need to know. I have faith. Okay, this should be me, not you. I don't have time to take these rags off, so go, just in case this, you know, doesn't work. No, oh, dude. Go. Hero moment. <sighs> What's happening? Roy! Oh. oh my god! Oh, he always gets the credit. Oh, are you okay? This means I get a promotion, right? <laughs> Yeah. Mm, I love Rory. I love Rory. Can we please keep Rory forever? Guys, this episode, there are twists and turns left and right, and I absolutely love it. Yeah, this is a good episode. Really good episode. Also, Felicity has faith that Rory can do it, but still, the moment she's outside that hangar and Oliver comes running up towards her straight in his arms straight you know give me a hug before it's it's too late for a hug because we might die <sighs> oh, I'm so happy just happy overall because it's it's working right now everything is working Tina Curtis Rory Renee we've got Lance back the moment Thea's back, I'm gonna be the happiest little fucker you've ever seen. Oh. <coughs> well, yeah, can't you hold your vodka? No, you're my favorite American. <laughs> you know, the Walker threatened J.J. and Lila just like Andy did. First, I wonder why I didn't shoot him like I did Andy. Then I remember what you said to me in Felicity. Well, I'm just glad that it took. But you know, Oliver, you were wrong. Me and Felicity went up better than you. You, me, Felicity. We make each other better. Drink to that. Yeah. Brother Albert. Fuck yeah, I'll drink to that. <sighs> Look at how strong this is over here. 
I make sure I bring some when I come to Star City. Yeah. When you come to Star City? Are you a mayor now? When you come to Star City? No, you pass up. Please come to Star City. That's not how. I need to check if that's the same bottle of vodka that Susan used. Hmm. I knew it. You know, if... I didn't say much. I just told a story. About you and me. <laughs> you and me? I figured you didn't remember. When I was a kid, you were a beat cop on my block. You caught me tagging a building. But instead of hauling me in, you crouched down, looked me in the eye and told me I could be more than just some rip run thug. It really set me on a better path. You did, I mean. I, I had no idea, Renee. Anyway, I just wanted the reporter to know just what kind of guy she was sitting down with. Within a span of two or three episodes, I've completely done a 180 on my feelings towards Renee. He made me tear up with that little story, you know? And it's 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 also because it ties into the lands a good guy, a good cop. Was a good cop. This episode is is hitting me right there in a good way. Are you going somewhere? Yeah, I'm sorry. I was I was gonna call. No nope. well, I was probably gonna whip out and text. What's going on? They don't work anymore? The blast did something to them. They don't work anymore. I don't have any control. They don't offer any protection. I'm sure it's just temporary. I'm not. I have a bond with them, Felicity. I can feel it. And let's be honest, without the rags, I'm a liability. No, you're and not. The team can't risk, not with Prometheus out there. Okay, well, that doesn't mean you have to leave. Don't worry. I'll be back. No. You'll, uh, you'll let the team know? Yeah. I mean, I'll probably just wimp out and text. Mm. No. I found something very interesting. The Russians call him Luchnik, the archer. Does it remind you anyone you know? The Green Arrow. What are the odds of Oliver Queen? The Green Arrow all being a rush at the same yeah. time. Very good. Mm. If Oliver Queen is the Green Arrow. Oh, for fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. Susan frickin' Williams. And I don't know this. I didn't know it because I don't read comic books and I didn't know Oliver Queen's story until Smallville happened. I think in the comic books, Oliver Queen outs himself as the Green Arrow to the people, to the city, to the press, to everyone. And it seems very, 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 very likely right now that that is what's going to happen. Oliver is going to find out that she's running a story on him, a big one, and he's going to out himself on his conditions, not hers, but his own, his own choice. Guys, this episode, oh my god. There were twists and turns here and there, everywhere, and I loved it. This was a really good episode. <sighs> Rory, oh fuck, I did not see that coming. Mm. Just when I was really happy with how things were working, you know, the whole team, the, the, this is now a group of people that I love, I love. Bring Thea back and I love it even more, but I'm happy. I'm happy about the people, the, the characters, the story, the... Just happy. I'm happy with everything. Yeah, we'll see you next week, okay?